Hello, today we're going to go over the basic setup and use of the WSVL44 Heavy Duty on the Vehicle Brake Lane. First thing you want to do is attach the cutting tool onto the corresponding tool holder. Choose the proper adapter ring for the specific hub of the vehicle. The measurements for this ring were done prior to delivery of the brake lane. If this has not been done, we have a measuring kit that we can send to you. Make sure the tool holder does not interfere with the caliper. Next, you want to attach the brake lane to the hub of the vehicle. Attach a lug nut on every other stud of the hub of the vehicle. Adjust the cutting bits so that it centers the loader to be cut. Use the hand wheel to move the cutting bits all the way to the inside of the face of the rotor. Adjust the knob to the desired cutting depth so that it just raises the face of the road. Turn on the main power switch. Make sure the emergency stop is disengaged. Press the start button. If the rotor is in really bad shape, you would want to do a rough cut. Push in this knob to activate the automatic feed. With this knob over here, you can adjust the feed speed. This machine is also equipped with an inverter, so you can adjust the revolutions per minute. Alternately, you can do a rough cut by using the hand wheel and turning it manually. Now that we've completed our rough cut, we're going to turn cutting bits all the way to the inside of the rotor and we're going to do our final cut. Loosen knob and adjust cutting bit knob one notch. Do the same for the other side. And tighten and we'll back up. For the final cut, we're going to use low revolutions per minute. Engage the hand wheel for the automatic cutting. During the cut, the mechanic is able to walk away since this machine is equipped with an automatic shuttle.
Now that the final cut is completed, you can safely remove the brake tape from the vehicle.